Hey there everybody and welcome to Blood West. I got this game probably a couple weeks ago. It is basically a retro style cowboy horror shooter type game. And I've been interested in playing it. And you know what? Let's just hop right into it. This land is cursed. Where my people roamed freely, now roams only death. It came with the white man on his iron horse. White man brought with him corruption, greed, vanity, ignorance. He killed on holy ground, and the great spirit has abandoned this place. The dead can no longer leave the mortal realm, restless. Enraged, they wander the earth, craving for more of living flesh. A fate worse than death, undeserving even for a stupid white man. Light still flickers within you, stranger. Go now, leave this place. May the great spirits take pity on you. May your soul find peace in the spirit world. I hate to say it, but I'm not gonna probably find peace for a while. All right. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. All right, let me go to options, language, yep, all that's good, all this is good. I'm not gonna mess with that at the moment. Okay. Ah, okay. Oh, it worked, it worked, and he is even in one piece. What, who are you? Oh, me? You mean us? Nothing but an amalgamation of souls. More important question is, who are you? I... I don't really know. The answer is, you're undead. We brought you here by means of our immense powers from whenever place you've been before. We know of your exploits and achievements. Your fame reaches wide across the country. The nasty rumors about you reach even further. You're our ace in a sleeve. Before you ask, no, we cannot send you back. Not yet. See, that's the nature of every summoning. It must have a reason. And a reason you have. As an undead outside of others' influence, you will be our torch in the dark. Your spark will become the flame to purify the rot of this world and free us from the unending cycle of despair. What should I do? Search for the evil lurking in this world. Smell the sulfur in the air. Taste the corruption. Understand the shattered reality. Sense the vitriol staining the remains. Only then will you be free again and able to leave. Okay. Let me just move this a little bit. All right. Hold control or you see. Uh, stay out of sight. Notice the detection meter near the bottom of the screen. At the top of the screen, you find a compass. Okay.
I just turned myself around. Oh, okay. He can't come in here. Good. A weapon is lying out there. You will find use for it for sure. What do we have here? All right. Equipping the weapon. Open your inventory with I. Equip the weapon. Primary slot. L2. Okay. Bandages. Oh, I got five dollars. So much for that. Haha. -ha. All right, what's over here? Oh. Can't say no to such a curiosity. Is this better? Primary damage is five. Primary damage is ten. No. I will use the sound off shotgun. Do I have to equip the ammo? Doesn't look like it. We'll keep ammo up there and equipment up there for now. All right. All right. We got two bullets in the chamber. Read note. The animated dead, seemingly mi seemingly mindless creatures born from malicious dark magic, do not seem to s to be a species worth observing. They can spend hours staring at a wall and apparently derive some sore pleasure from it, or shamble senselessly around until they spot a living being. Eventually, the sight awake. Uh, the sight awakes murderous instincts in them behavior while these pitiful creatures do not pose a serious threat for an experienced hunter only a fool would disregard an entire group of them when they notice a living being they try to tear it apart with their claws at times they may perform a charge displaying a remarkable speed that may prove fatal to a fledgling hunter okay so be careful when they charge at you That's where I came. That's the outcove I was just on. Okay. Remember the check. Oh, you could loot bodies. You have. While equipped, it protects you from obtaining a new soul flaw. Oh, okay. What's a soul flaw? No idea. And that, I believe, is just a potion. Yeah, okay. Wait, is it a single use? Yep, single use, okay. And here you go. Oh. All right, now we got a revolver and you hit V, switch between ammo and R for reload. Now do I want a rusty revolver or sawed off? Probably revolver, cause I have more ammo. All right. You won't find any answers lingering here. Better move towards the dark places and glimmering gold. Again, what should I do? Search for the evil lurking in this world. Okay. Press J, okay. All right, so I'm gonna find someone to tell me basically what's going on. Learn 
Okay, X to select stones and Q and E to peek. All right. There's a guy down there. Oh, there's the shaman who buried me. You can trade here. For example, buying maps may prove useful. Some enemies may respawn upon your death after, or after you take a rest. Speak to the shaman and the totem of souls. Hello there. What is it? A dead man I buried walks again. I sense the restless spirits nearby, but still I hoped your body would be protected by my charms. They were insufficient, as it seems. What happened to me? I found a body, your body, among the remains of monsters, and decided to bury you in a manner akin to my tribe. I did all the proper rituals, but it was not enough, and strong spirits have brought you back. I do not know if this is for a good for bad purpose. Who are you? I... I am nobody. Used to talk to spirits, guide the tribe. Now, now tribe shattered. I remain in shame, wandering the lands, trying to fix what can be fixed and lay to rest what is too broken. Okay, I have no more questions, I guess. Or is that the same? I found a body. Oh, okay, yeah, I have no more good. questions. Good. Walk on, tainted one, and let your journey bring closure. I would go towards the town if I were you. Find tracks of iron horse and follow them. I saw one of your tribe around ruins, searching for something. Maybe he knows something of your past, or maybe not. Can I help you? <laughs> you, you want to help. Ah, restless soul you are. But there's something you could do. Take this packet. Journey past the tracks of fiery iron horse. Find a cave which used to be a burial site for many of my tribe. Leave it there. It will help the spirits. And if you kill any creatures disturbing the peace of spirits, it will be for greater good. I will do it. I thank you. Tainted one, there's nothing I can give you, but I am sure you will find something of use in the cave. Okay, level up, H. Oh, this is interesting. Actually seems useful. Deadly precision. Okay, what do we got though? Fast hand. One who draws faster when increased melee attack speed by 10%. Okay, better grip of your weapon can make a huge difference. Decrease firearm reload time by 25%. Okay. You won't take me down that easily. Increase max HP. So that will just increase my max HP. Invisible man. Sneaking is easier. That might be useful if I want to do stealth. Right, this makes perfect. Left, right, left again. Uh, light and heavy attacks require 15% left stamina. Hmm, okay. Strong lungs, breathe in and out. This basically... Okay, increases your stamina regeneration. Gold prospector. Trading prices are 10% more in favor of the player. Okay. Bloody carnage. The end justifies the means. Each kill restores 25% maximum stamina. Okay. Steady aim. Lessens the wep weapon's sway when aiming. Also could be useful. Bloodless. I ain't got time to bleed. 
Uh, decreased damage from bleeding by 25%. Elusive target. Enemies have a 10% chance to miss their, uh, their attack. So it's automatic. Quick fingers. Handy way to reload weapons, bows, and other non firearm and other non firearm weapons. That might be useful if I want to do a bow. High tolerance, alcohol, okay. Pitcher increased damage from thrown weapons and distance. Comfort weapon, ain't no problem for solid iron, can't solve. Piece of solid iron. With a melee weapon in hand, my stamina regenerates faster. Gotcha. Effective range of headshots are increased. Medical training, increased healing from bandages. Okay. Adrenaline rush when HP drops below 30%. The damage of all melee attacks are increased to 75. Huh. Be interesting. Deadly precision, I'm thinking of, because that could be useful. Strong back increases inventory. Self taunt increases. Well, oh, might be useful too. Uh, thick skinned resistance to explosions, reflexes. Enemies will miss ranged attacks and berserker. I'm gonna go deadly precision. It's a one level up one. I might as well. Dead man walking. Speak. Let's trade. Um, you have a satchel for 200. I'm gonna sell this. How much is it? That is a dollar. You know what? You can have it. Also, this is $10. You can have it. This is also $10, but I'm gonna keep it. Oh, a bow, 70. That's also a really nice knife. Um, it says you had a map. I'll take the map of the canyon. I have $26 remaining. I'm happy. Anything I could take from his camp? No, okay. Since you are here, let us explain what is needed of you. This place has been corrupted by a curse, and you need to find its source. We don't know what has brought it to this land, so keep your eyes open. Bring us anything you may deem weird or disturbing. And if you happen to get lost, come to us. We may be able to help or ease your burden. For now, we know where you can begin your search. Follow the most strong scent of darkness around, under the burned church. Within ruined city, you will find part of your answers. Anything else? No, I'm gonna leave. I'm good. I need to bring cursed items to the totem, and okay, we got this. Jim Hooper, whoever that is. The shaman wants me to go here. Oh, sweet, so I'm here. Okay, yeah, let's just go there first. I would love to try shooting. Oh, I only got so much ammo. Nope. Bullseye! Well, that was... Awesome. Yeah, there's no salvage I can grab. Ooh, there's a safe. It needs a key though. Right, this might not go well for me if they turn around. Luckily, I got a revolver. <laughs> Ashes to ashes. Oh. Oh, no. Okay, so yeah, these guys are slow. It's easier to sneak up on them. Shooting probably does a really good amount of damage, but I feel like it's also going to make noise. I can also, if I remember correctly, throw rocks, which in every stealth game is useful. Depending on how this game is, maybe I'll try a stealth build. 
All right, I got bandage. All right. Three zombies down. Basically at end game now. Oh. Okay. I see you. Aim for the head. Always aim for the head. Hit M. Okay, I want to go down this path. Yeah. Okay. We'll do the uh, thing for the shaman since it's right here and then we'll move on. Oh, that's not good. Yeah. The burial site's being defiled, all right. See, it doesn't hurt now. I'm just gonna make sure he's dead. Oh, jeez. Um, hmm. One second. Oh. Got him. Okay, okay, okay. Oi, what's this? I've cleansed the burial site. What? No, I didn't. You unpack the little package that could and, and its contents spread all over you. Everything seems more quiet and calmer than before. Never enough. I hear you over there. All right, that is something I cannot touch. Oh. Hey. Don't come back. Yeah, he saw me, but luckily he's dead. Okay, it looks like I just got a bunch of bandages and some arrows, which, hey, you know what? Bandages this early on will probably be nice and useful. Also, I got, oh, wait. Hello. I will need that. Never mind. I got a bow and a raven I have a skull. feeling this will come in handy. Another gold coin. All right, give me a second. What does the raven skull do? Oh, never mind, it's gone. All right, teeth are actually expensive. I want to sell those. A silver mug, 20 bucks, and the bow. Mm. All right, I'm probably, if I had guessed, bows have reusable ammo, so it's... Okay, yeah, no, I can't put that up there. Can I rotate? Oh, I can. Excellent. Mm-hmm-hmm. <laughs> We're playing uh, Resident Evil now. Oh, there it is. Use this teleport to the last safe place you bound your soul to. Okay. Hmm. All right. I will say this, a bow and arrow is worth doing this quest for, 100%. And bandages. I'm happy about the bandages too. Now I'm over here. I can always go back and sell some items. There's probably fall damage, even though I'm undead. Actually, I never actually looked down. Oh, okay, no, this is just ceremony barrel site. Okay, okay. 
right, we got bow and arrow and um, a mug. And that must be the slow, the time slowdown thing that keeps happening. Yeah, you can't just put a safe right there and not let me have it. I'm what we call a loot whore. I need it all. No, nothing. I love games that look like this nowadays. Then again, I am an old, so I like old retro games. PS1, PS2 is where it's at. Hello, sir. Ah, I sense the spirits of my tribe are pleased. Accept my words of thanks. Many a spirit here. Alright, I'm gonna s do, 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 do. I'm gonna sell the teeth. You can have that. Is there a quick sell button? Probably not. You can have that too. And I'm gonna. I was thinking of selling that, but probably not best. Stick that there. Okay. Um, that's a hunting bow. Already got one. That's a knife, don't need it. That's a satchel, would like to actually use that. Um, a bone knife. Oh, that, oof, 700 though. Ooh, that's expensive. Um, shotgun ammo, short ammo. Is that what I use, short ammo? Okay, I'll buy some short ammo. And I still got $74. Um, I'm still gonna, yeah, I'm gonna hold on. No, 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 no. I don't want that yet. I'm actually $16 for arrows. No, no, let's not mess with that. <laughs> okay, I'm happy at the moment. I'm gonna see what bow and arrow is like. Oh, it has to be primary. Oh. Alright, one sec. Let me move things. Alright, let's see what an arrow, bone arrow, is like. You have to give up your melee weapon though to use the bow and arrow. Okay, let's go to Jim Hooper or whoever or whatever that is. I'm not getting anywhere being here. Oh wait, what's that? Cigar box. Oh, $20. There is loot just lying around. Oh no, that's bad for the loot because I'm going to collect it. All right, there's a guy. Oh yeah, beautiful. Now that went well. Oh, I broke the arrow. Unless that's how it looks like when you retrieve it. I'll pay attention next time. Oh, I sway. Oh, I hate that. Wretch. Okay, I have one out of nine. And this. Oh no, I just, I suck. Oh no. Okay, I like the bow and arrow, but I'd rather wait. Oh, no, come on. Not enough inventory space, please, sir. Of course there is. 
Okay, oh, one sec. I gotta move some things around again. I'm gonna hold on to that. I'm gonna have to probably level up my area arrow recovery because, uh, ooh, do not like that. Do not like breaking arrows. Even though it's a small chance to break your arrows, probably. I don't want to do that at the beginning of the game when my resources are limited. And stay down. There we go. Oh, what's this? Just I'll what I was looking for. Shadow. What's that do? A small bottle colors concoction. Drinking allows you to blend in with your surroundings. Ah, sneaking is more effective for 40% by 240 seconds, and it's a pretty decent penny. My new favorite thing. Note of the. Okay. A thorough observation of the species known among those traversing the bear lands as the prodigal daughter could yield interesting results. While it retained a human form, at least at first glance, the damage dark the damage dark magic inflicted on her mind is severe. If she did not lose the ability to speak, the creature suffers from a serious case of megalomania and sees herself as a beautiful young lady who demands a total unconditional admiration from the entire world around her. At the same time, she keeps wearing a mask that, con that conceals deformations of her face and a hideous grimace her weapon of choice is a shotgun great behavior therefore it's best to kill the prodigal daughters as swiftly as possible as the prolonged combat may prove fatal shooting her in the face will break her mask making her more aggressive which might not be ideal anything that reveals her ugliness be it a living being or an ordinary mirror becomes a target of her furious attacks. She will not rest until her target is destroyed or she herself is vanquished. Do not shoot her face. Understood. Oh, spirits, I think. Okay, so that means I'm about to come across a not dead but deformed girl who I should never aim for the face of got it all right where am I there's a canyon over there there's a path over there there's a mine over there but let's see who this Jim Hooper is oh mines fort town Let's go to the fort. I mean, you can't just not go to the fort. Oh, that guy looks different. Yeah, you know what? Let's go to town. Checking to see if there's anything up here. There's not. Okay. Player stash. Immediately sticking this in here. I do not plan on using that for a while. Same with you. And these two. I can sell you and you know I'm gonna stick this these bandages in here. I'll hold on to everything else. Actually, don't mm, first room, I'm gonna get rid of the Oh wait, no. Ah, wait, what that's short. Gold short oh. Oh, that's actually really good. How do I change my ammo in this?
New face around these parts? <laughs> Come in. It's safe here. Unlike most of this area. You're one of those bravados looking to make a quick buck? Just don't come back to me crying about all them monsters. All I care about is that I get my share and stay out of trouble. Okay, what's going on? Listen, there really isn't much to say. You certainly figured this place ain't normal or safe. Don't expect a warm welcome from locals either. But if you know your stuff, you can make a coin or two pillaging and scavenging. Or killing monsters, if you're so inclined. If I were you, though, I would stay quiet. And if you really want to get to the heart of the evil, well, you're on a good track. There's an old burned church around here, and that's already quite nasty. But where's money in that? Better to scavenge whatever you can, sell it, and leave the damn place to rot for all I care. Okay. So once again, go to the church. All right, let's see what you have on you. Ooh, my, oh man, you got some items. Okay, a pocket watch. Time stops when an inventory screen. Hmm. Okay. Drink a soul catcher, increases maximum stamina. Gold mead increases movement speed by 20% for 240 seconds. Oh, that would reduce penalty for lack of. Okay. First things first, I don't need this. And here, have some teeth. I'm up to 80. I'm gonna get. No, 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 no. I don't need another map of the canyon. Which you sell for. 40, yeah, which is right, yeah. No, I was about to say it's expensive, but same price. Solid shotgun. Is there anything I can kind of afford? Not really. Orb of Night. Damage inflicted to... Uh, oh. The backpack? Probably intrigues me the most but yeah he doesn't really have anything for me all right give me a second let's go to options key bindings how do you change the all right right shoulder r switch ammo v thank you oh i just don't think i could change the ammo in it oh well oh hope it's not cursed I got a letter from the bird man Many people consider these creatures. Oh, that must have been the people I saw at the fort Okay, most people consider these creatures to be most disturbing of all that haunt the barren lands I myself have to admit that There is something profoundly sinister about the bird man from distance It may be taken for a person as it retains a humanoid bipedal form However, the closer you get the more peculiar appears appearance becomes and when it starts shrieking, any semblance of humanity vanishes immediately. Behavior. Extremely agile, the Birdman is capable of wielding firearms with deadly accuracy. It can also dodge with remarkable swiftness, employing short distance flight. Silver bullets, although costly, seem the most effective means to slay the creature. The vulnerability to silver put the Birdman in the same ranks as spirits. Curious. So silver's for basically spirits hey, and bird. Have a minute. You could help a fella and earn uh -oh. something on the side. Okay. Thanks, pal. So here's the deal. I know of a few places worth looting, and I'm sure something is there that can make a good buck. You bring it to me, and I'll share the spoils with you. If you find anything else, you keep it. I know there is an artifact in that ruined watchtower that overlooks the town. The damn place is haunted by spirits, and I don't have the courage to fight them or sneak past. Bring that artifact to me, and I will pay you. Okay, so I'm gonna need something on. I'm gonna need silver bullets, is what you're saying. What's the chicken head do? Okay. 
unrest, teleport to other safe zones. Using this item will not respawn enemies. Or the silver bullets. If I'm doing silver shotgun, shotgun, short ammo, gold ammo. Okay, so you don't sell regular silver. I have $93. I actually got enough for something now, if I want it. The launch. That's cool, but no. Ah, there's not much here. I oh, wait, I forgot the cigar box. Oh, you can grow your inventory. Okay, that's actually really useful. All right. This is looking better now. Um, I have $113. And I'm going to put the chicken's head in here for now. Oh, excuse me. So you want me to go to the tower, which is over there. Gold always breeds greed and attracts evil. All right, you just have the same stuff to say to me. So I want to go east to the tower. I can also go to the mine or I can search the church, the farm. There's a burial site. Yeah, there's a, quite a bit to actually look at right now. Let's be risky and... No, I can only save if I... Oh, right. Uh, we're in the town. How do you see what experience you got? Okay, I'm halfway to level three. And when I do, I'm probably going for... Uh, where is it? One second, I'm blind. Probably quick fingers. I got a feeling bow and arrow is going to be a gr... Asset. That sounds big. Those are small steps that might be the woman form that the note warned me about. Take go. Yep, no, 100%, that's a lady. Also, let's get a better look at you. Yeah. Oh, there's a bird man. Okay. I am in a bad place right now. literally outside the door there's nothing else in here are you looking at me no the question is can I sneak up on the bird man and stab him in the back also or is he too strong for that danger yet I mean I'm not safe but I'm not in danger yet hello yeah there's more in there than I thought mm hmm what 
to do. What to do? We might have to do this. Diamonds are forever. Yeah, I am eternal. Whatever you say, darling. Uh oh. That bad place. Very bad place. If I can take out all the small fry, it will make taking out everyone. Oh. Oh. Thank you. That was actually extremely useful. What I can do is pick these guys off from here. No, 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 no. Like, no, no. Uh, it's a hundred percent not what I wanted. One and done. I got a feeling I just. All right, we're doing this. <laughs> Yeah. Disgusting filth. Oh. Okay, I got shot once. I'm gonna use a bandage because I got a bunch of them. I need to know how much it heals. All right, not much. Okay, so I let's reload. Am I gonna waste that bullet? I am not. Okay, good. That didn't go as bad as I thought, but... Oh. Oh, sweet. You're giving me a revolver. I'll take that. I can sell it, too. Ooh, give me my bandage back. Okay, you have no loot for me. Okay, that wasn't as bad as I thought it would be. I know I can loot that guy. Just give me a second. Oh, ho. A rusty axe and healing potion I will take will I break yep I suck hellish spawn will it break uh. All right, there's shotgun ammo. Oh, another healing potion, and that's a knife. Shame I can't pick it up because I could probably sell it for something good. Die! Oh, ho, ho, ho. Birdmen can die from headshots. Confirmed. Okay. Okay, I retrieved an arrow, finally. Retrieve? Oh, hello. Is there a way I can unload these guns? That'd be great. Oh, I can. Awesome. Good. These are junk guns. I'm going to sell them. This is a... Uh, these axes are the same, right? Yeah. One second. This is my axe. These are junk guns. That's a junk axe, which I'm going to leave down there for now, yeah. Shotgun ammo, healing potion. I'll leave that there. Okay. I have slightly more ammo now for my revolver. Nothing, 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 nothing. Oh, well. Oh, got itch. All right. 
Okay. I don't think I want to confront spirits yet because I don't exactly have anything I don't know that can hurt them. Tumbleweed. Ow. You know, I stood pl I stood in place. I had no one to blame but myself for that. Mm, spicy. Yeah, no one to blame but myself. Crow feathers are ten dollars each. Wait, oh, I actually have something. Increased stamina regeneration, but lowers maximum stamina. You know, why not? All right, come here. You're selling material and unload. Awesome, awesome. Actually, I'm going to put you there. I'm going to put you there. Then whatever gets the job done. How much are these? Five dollars each. That's five. That's 20 bucks. All right, another feather, and let me just pop another bandage on, because I'm about to do stupid things. All right, I still got three arrows. Oh, wait, a silver knife, so, um, um, okay. It's just selling. I'll take the bandage because uh, I hurt myself a little bit. And what's that? What's, Strange. What's that? Increases damage. Oh, no, 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 no. Do not use. Hold on to that. That is a hold on item. Cigar box, 20 bucks. Okay, stick that with the rest. I think right now we got a good haul. I can either go back and sell or push my luck and attempt to say hi to the nice lady. Oh, I'm gonna shoot you through the window, so hold still. Destroyed! Thank you. Back up, back up, back up. Baby, got him. Get into my gun already. There, wasn't there three guys in here? All right, remember, she uses a shotgun. This place is wasted on my talent. I don't regret this. Just shoot anything but her face. Do not shoot the face. Can't say no to such a curiosity. All right, sawed off shotgun, 20 bucks. I want to see her face. Bit by bit. I will serve you anything you decide. Go, 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 go. I hope your days will be stunned by my beauty. Stay dead, pal! Damn it. Well, Not even another death can stop me. I got a soul flaw. <sighs> I 
Uh, your maximum HP is lowered by 2%. Well, damn it. I almost got her. I mean, I did get her, but still. All right, I, I, I already got the sawed up shotgun, so, uh, hey. Keep your eyes out. What? I am full of loot. Take it. All of Really? Take it. Thank you. Um, I'm gonna hold on to the whetstone for now. Army does want to sell it though. Doesn't stack, sell. Okay. We have two hundred dollars. We're getting up there real slowly, but we're getting there. I can get an axe, which is thirteen damage, because a rusty axe has. Get rid of that. I don't need that. And we got ammo. Dreamcatcher. Knife. Bowler hat. Reduces damage from... Oh, okay. Well, uh, that went as well as I think it was going to go. Sadly. All right, we're gonna stick some short ammo in here. We're gonna hold on to the silver ammo because where I'm going, I'm probably gonna need it. We'll stick that in there. And, okay. We are gonna go to the tower and then probably call it. And the enemies all respawn, don't they? So uh, let me just equip that, cause at the moment, yeah. Yep, they all respawn. Damn it, I did kill her, and then a weird buff one came out and let my guard down. Oh. Nope, nope. That was brief. Well, now my maximum HP is lowered by 10%. Okay, 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 okay. So there's a lot more over there than I thought. Let's go in. each other they hurt each other that's actually great for me the whispers told me you're coming I'm wasting silver bullets get ready You guys killed her, not me. Actually, maybe I'll use that.
Let's immediately swap ammo. I'm going to go for stim. Wait, this is the right one, right? Yes. Oh, wait, it says I still have some experience. Oh, I got three. Okay, um, we'll do Invisible Man. There we go. So now we got some ammo. This game will definitely get extremely challenging later on. I can already feel it and it's gonna be great. Okay, there's a glove there, but I can't pick it up. Bone, what looks like a potion, but it's not. Oh, 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 gimme, gimme, gimme. Little guys for big jobs. Okay, I got some shotgun ammo. The tower should be dead ahead. That must be the tower. Okay. The cannon. What looks like a. Is that a regular? No, it's a bird man. What are these? Nope. Nope. Yeah, that's right. Shoot your friend. Shoot your friend. Oh, this is great. Use them against each other. Again. You have been cursed. Seek good help from Totem. Okay. Um, oh, lowered by 25%. That is harsh. Then again, I did it to myself. All right. Find a solid piece. All right, sir. I want you to. Oh, I can just double click on these. That actually is better than what I was doing before. We'll stick. I don't know, we'll move you, we'll, there we go. I need more arrows. A lot more arrows. <laughs> All right, coach gun was useful for a bit, but I think it's time to get rid of it. I'm gonna take the ammo. I'm gonna also put the silver ammo in here with the gold ammo. You have the eyes of the Lament ye poor soul For there is a stench of a curse upon you With each curse you will grow weaker and weaker But maybe we could help Could you remove the curse from me? It could be arranged, yes We would even do it for free but we need a certain thing. What do you need? Let's see. The spirit of Great Cat looks upon you. Kill the accursed ones in a way that will make the spirit pleased. Be unseen by eyes of your enemies and surprise them with their death. Okay, I could do that. I could do stealth. 
Also, I'm gonna go back to the shaman. I have money now, and I would love to uh, get more arrows because he's not selling me arrows. I'm gonna also want to do the fort one day. This is all just a learning experience. I'm bound to die, I'm bound to do this, I'm bound to do that. <gasps> I suck. Report me, please. Damn it. And then I upgraded the stealth perk so it's easier for me to sneak up and I I got the bow and arrow perk, but apparently I still suck at it. There we go. Give me your teeth. They're actually worth this decent amount of money. Somehow my health is permanently like this until I get enough stealth kills, is what they're saying. Which stealth's nice. I like stealth. Oh wait, I never went in here. It's never enough. Another no. And uh, yep, yeah, okay. Let's see. Notes on spirits. Oh, I'm gonna need this. The specific properties of dark magic permeating the barren lands remains unknown and spirits and yet another proof how little we understand the phenomena. For a long time it was assumed that only matter can be subjected to deformations and assume new odd forms. A discovery of spirits rendered that view, view obsolete as we saw proof that even an essence of a living being, especially that of a human, can be altered and made visible to the naked eye. Behavior. The ethereal nature of spirits makes them less vulnerable to traditional firearms, but silver ammunition proved itself to be effective. Experienced marksmen know how to bait spirits and provoke them to charge that is and when the torment souls are the most exposed. Okay. Hello? Many is. I would like to sell this note to you. This tooth, this feather, and this tooth. Okay, we have $306. Oh. I want that. Oh. Oh. I use health for every arrow, but they're not subject to gravity. Like, I have a decent amount of money now. Yeah. I'll take what you got for the bow ammo for now. That bow. I want the spirit bow. The problem is, is it uses my health. Hmm. Okay, but I think I'm gonna stop it here for now. I got a decent amount. So yeah, it was mostly a learning day. I am enjoying the game, it is definitely good. I need to get better, but it was mostly me just messing around and finding out, which is the best way of learning, honestly. So yeah, I'll probably see you next time and we'll probably try and take the tower and check out the fort and a few other things, but until then, I'll see you later and bye.